Hey guys, welcome back to the Wild Dog Project 365, episode 461. Today what we're doing is taking care of that nasty medial elbow point pain. They call it medial epicondylitis or medial epicondylopathy, depending on how long you might have had it and if there's infiltration of inflammatory cells. But uh, that's kind of um, semantics. Right now, medial elbow pain, pain on the inside of the elbow, we get it a lot from gripping activities, okay? We've shown in the past different ways to roll it out with the barbell. But today what we have is we have a dumbbell. Dumbbells work really well because they're smaller and you're able to maneuver them a lot better, right? They're not as clumsy. Now you can use it just like we've showed in the past, the, the barbell movements where you're going to roll up over top. But sometimes these, these um, uh, conditions, they're so sensitive that we can't necessarily put a lot of pressure on. So we can make controlled amounts of pressure by taking different weights of dumbbells. In this case, this one's an eight pound weight. I can go ahead and remember the medial epicondyle is right there. That's it. That's that sucker right there. Coming down from it, okay, is where all the flexor tendons in my hand um, are located. So basically, I want to be able to treat this entire area from the wrist all the way up to the elbow. And if I if I have a like a moderate to lightweight dumbbell, this works really well as a controlled pressure because it's much less pressure than I would do is if I was rolling it on uh, myself, flip it over like this. Now, of course, you can um, you can flip it over like this and and modulate the pressure yourself but it's hard to get a consistent pressure right so that's why i like just flipping this sucker over here like this it's simple it's easy and uh it works really well in those acute type situations if you need more pressure obviously again you're going to flip back over but the idea is using the dumbbell as a rolling device rather than just letting it sit in the side of the gym because uh it works really really well cool guys hope this helps you out and until tomorrow we're optimizing function optimized performance